In this demonstration, we will display the power of the LivePerson Agent API, which has been introduced in LivePerson's version 9.3. In the following video, we will show you how a virtual agent application uses the Agent API to communicate with the visitor on the website. The virtual agent application is logged into the LivePerson using the Agent API and the username VA. This user is assigned to the skill named VA. On the right hand side you can see the LivePerson Agent Console and on the left a website that is monitored by LivePerson. A visitor clicks the chat button and the chat window is displayed. LivePerson assigns the chat to the VA skill so the chat is taken by the virtual agent application that is logged in as an agent belonging to the skill. Note that the text the visitor sees indicates that they are chatting with a virtual agent named Sarah. This virtual agent application has been configured to perform a reset password procedure for visitors. Therefore, the virtual agent asks the visitor if they are interested in resetting the password. In our example, the visitor is not interested in this procedure, so the virtual agent transfers the chat to a real agent. The real agent continues to chat with the visitor. During this chat session, the agent understands that the visitor does need a password reset, so the chat is transferred back to the virtual agent via the Live Person Transfer to Skill feature. As you can see, the visitor continues to chat with the virtual agent. Now that the visitor says a password reset is required, the virtual agent proceeds to ask for relevant information. To summarize, you have seen how the live person is used to manage the chat flow. The system has been configured so the chats start with a virtual agent, but since the chats are passed through the live person server, all live person chat capabilities can be used. You have also seen that the chat can be transferred both ways, from a virtual agent to a real agent and back. The virtual agent application was developed by LivePerson as a demo application. Its source can be found on the developer's community.